In the search for an alternative to antibiotics, probiotics are making headway into the animal protein producing sector. Christian Hansen is one of several companies with a range of probiotic products on the market. All About Feed visited them at their headquarters in Denmark to find out how the probiotic market is developing and what more can be expected from this promising feed additive. Can you explain briefly what a probiotic is and what the definition is of a probiotic? Yeah, the definition comes from the World Health Organization that states probiotics is a living microorganism that, when administered in adequate amounts, confer a health or performance benefit to the hosting animal. To take that a step further, can you explain the main benefits of probiotic use in poultry and, and livestock production that you've already seen or noticed in the field? Yes, essentially probiotics uh, address the, the fact that you have experienced imbalances in the gut and these imbalances lead to imbalances in the entire system of the animal. Probiotics help uh, restore this imbalance by inhibiting harmful pathogenic bacteria but also promoting the beneficial ones and as a consequence you get improved intestinal integrity and function which in turn leads to improved animal performance, welfare and health. Looking at the, the, the challenges customers face at the moment in the animal production industry, um, how can probiotics help address those challenges? How can a farmer or a nutritionist use these probiotic products? Yeah, it's, um, well, the specific challenges of, of customers vary by livestock segment and region, but one challenge that certainly unites them across uh, the different segments is the need for to sustain profitability in an environment where the raw material cost fluctuates and where the output prices so they also fluctuate. Um, here we have an offering that can help whether you want to improve performance on top of your existing setup or you want to maintain performance and lower your costs. So at the moment we've taken that concept into the poultry business where we're working with a concept called flexible feed formulation. Um, and we've proven over a number of trials that you can reduce dietary energy content in, in, the, in the feed with two, at least 2%. And actually maintain or even improve the bird performance compared to the group that was fed 100% diet without probiotics. Um, so here was one example from the poultry industry and that's also um, achieving a lot of attention at the moment given the antibiotic focus in the US and so on. Um, for producers who are looking for ways to, to reduce or eliminate antibiotics completely, uh, can probiotics provide an effective alternative? To antibiotics. What is your opinion about that? If you look to therapeutic usage, you have a sick animal that's receiving um, a dose of antibiotics to, to recover from this, this illness. And here, probiotics can certainly play a role because it can help protect that intestinal balance and help the animal recover faster from both the illness and the treatment. Um, if we turn to AGPs, I would say that there is no uh, direct substitute to, to antibiotics. It's a complex issue. Um, but any management strategy should definitely be a holistic one that encompasses probiotic that, that will play a natural role here. Uh, studies that we have conducted have shown that under proper management conditions you can get the same feed efficiency and weight gain using probiotics as you can with antibiotics. And I think also it's a question of, uh, it's not necessarily a question of, of either or, one or the other. Uh, because we've also done research showing the combined effect of it. So in a, in a challenge study with necrotic enteritis, we showed that combining antibiotics and probiotics lead to better feed efficiency, better weight gain than if you only use antibiotics. In terms of research and development, you do here at Christian Hansen, I'm sure you, your aim is to make the products even better and more efficient for, for animal production. Um, can you explain what Christian Hansen is doing at the moment to make the probiotics for feed applications even better? Mm. So Christian Hansen have been selecting and producing bacteria strains for more than 120 years. And over that time span we've certainly um, brought to the world a number of breakthrough innovations. But I think we still have the most exciting times ahead of us when we talk about probiotics because essentially it's a living microorganism. And uh, there's really no limit to how we can keep evolving uh, this category. At this time, many customers are asking us not so much uh, questioning whether to use a probiotic, 
but more asking us how can we extract more value from, from your products. Uh, and that's where we're investing a lot of, of, of focus at the moment, trying to develop and, and further our knowledge and applying our scientific evidence in a more granular way um, to help customers get the most out of our products.